If your freedom was taken away, but you still felt free, would it matter? If you were told lies, but this made you happy, would it matter? If you had to give up your privacy to connect with others, would it matter? If your body and mind was controlled by computers, would it matter? If any of this concerns you, then you may be interested in this video on ethics and technology. Welcome to Talk Today. Subs and likes both feed the algorithm and make me happy. Today we're going to look at some of the ethical issues arising from the creation and use of technology. There are far more details at the link in the video description. Ethical issues arising from technology include accessibility, productivity, diversity, privacy, and autonomy. Let's quickly look at each in turn. The internet promised a more equal world of access to knowledge, and everyone having the opportunity to become a knowledge producer. A veritable golden knowledge democracy. Alfred Schutz describes a world in which digital platforms have enabled ordinary people to challenge a knowledge elite, breaking down in-group, out-group barriers. However, not all commentators would agree with this. Access to knowledge varies depending on where you live in the world, your socioeconomic status, and your language. This is known as the digital divide. Moreover, it perpetuates existing inequalities, such as gender and race, as marginalized communities are often the ones who lack access to technology and internet. The digital divide is an example of technology widening the gap of power between those with, and without, access to the technology. This is a recurring theme that we will see arising from many different types of technology across history. Looking at productivity and fulfillment, the application of technology should increase productivity, giving us more of everything we like, including improved workplace relations, more opportunities for social and economic mobility and leisure time. This is technology having significant positive ethical effects. John Shepard found in his research in the oil industry that the application of technology increased productivity, and therefore increased the free time that workers have to spend doing things that they find intrinsically fulfilling. Further, technology increased the specialization of their roles which actually increased the autonomy and personal involvement that the oil workers enjoyed in their jobs. However, in his account of working on the Ford Motor Company production line Robert Blauner described the negative feelings that come from a lack of control over his work, a lack of involvement in his work, and a loss of a sense of purpose. He called these emotions alienation. It could be argued that this process of separation of the individual from themselves, and their wider knowledge community, reduces the knowledge that may be acquired and constructed in collaboration with others as we are put into silos by technology. Further, it could be argued that the feelings of powerlessness and estrangement caused by the technology reduce the individual's self-efficacy for the pursuit of knowledge. These are just a few of the negative ethical effects of technology. Arguably technology makes us work harder, longer and with less personal fulfillment at the end. The ethical issues arising from medical technology are wide and, in many ways, quite complex. There are huge positive ethical benefits to preventing disease and extending life. However, there are also significant ethical concerns. If you want to know more check out the blog from the link in the video description. Paradoxically technology both diversifies the range of knowledge producers available whilst also homogenizing the knowledge acquired by the knower. Technology often creates a homogenizing effect on cultures, leading to a decrease in diversity, which can have both positive and negative ethical implications. If you are currently carrying a data-connected phone you are sharing lots of data with private corporations, and possibly government organizations. As such you are willingly diluting your privacy. This may have implications for your autonomy, and the control that external forces can place on you. Sorry that this is not the happiest of our videos, we have happier ones available on the Talk Today channel. In conclusion, the ethical implications of technology are complex and wide-ranging, and should be carefully considered when thinking about the construction and acquisition of knowledge. For more details check out the link in the video description. Subscriptions and likes are an ethical action. Thank you for watching, and have a talk-tastic day. Bye.